Hey everyone and welcome to another video. So today we're taking a look at a few more products from Zero Wireless. So Zero Wireless um, have supported the channel quite a lot in the past, not monetarily, but just by sending me products for the review and they've done a similar thing again. So one of the products that we have from them today is their new power supply. So this is the new 65 watt power supply that they've made, USB-C PD. And alongside that, they've also sent me their new battery pack as well so this is their battery pack version 2 so first thing we'll do is we'll just quickly take a look at the actual uh, power supply unit first and we'll get this out of the way so this obviously me being in the UK this comes with the UK plug on it let's get that to focus in so it's the three pin plug it does come with two USB-C as well as one USB-A plug and obviously you can use all of these at the same time it will be pd so obviously it will figure out how much charge it can deliver to each particular device connected and automatically regulate that perfect for anybody that's got a sort of magsafe setups where they've got multiple charging docks um, you need something like this in order to actually charge it off so that's that's obviously something that anybody out there that's interested in something like that they can look into alongside that you'd also get a braided usb type c cable so this is a pretty high quality cable from what i've tested so far so yeah that's that's their new power supply unit for anybody out there that might be in the market for a new power supply. Okay, so putting that aside, um, what I wanted to mainly concentrate on this video was their new uh, battery pack. So I already have their version one MagSafe battery pack. So this is one that they actually uh, produced, I think it was last year may have been a little uh, earlier than that but basically with this it came with um, this sort of unique stand and that was one of the things that actually made it very different to a lot of the other solutions out there where it was both a stand as well as a, a sort of battery pack and charger all in one they've gone away and they've made a few changes and they've actually scrapped that part of it altogether and they've got more down the line of this the sort of apple uh, magsafe battery pack on the old one just to remind you it did have a button on the bottom you press that to check your charge and if we just remind ourselves so this one was a 3000 milliamp hour battery and we'll take a look at what we get in the new one so we'll just pop the battery to a side for a second uh, you'd also get a little certificate uh, sort of pamphlet telling you how to use it how to charge it everything like that and then you also get one of these uh, braided USB-C type cables as well. Once again, as I say, a uh, nice high quality cable that comes with it. So when you're charging it, you've not got to worry about anything like like that okay so taking a look at the battery pack itself as you can see this is a lot more reminiscent of the actual apple battery pack so it's much more similar in terms of having the the ring magnets visible you also have the locator magnet as well to stop it rotating around on the back as you can see they've, they've gone a very different route so rather than having the stand they're now sort of consolidated into that same sort of design as similar to the apple one where you have this imprinted sort of uh, glossy zero logo I try and get that the right way around so just like that and the rest of it is more of a satin finish so it will unfortunately show some fingerprints from grease and uh, stuff like that but it, it does wipe off quite easily and most importantly it won't snag on anything so if you have connected this to your phone and you take it out of your pocket then it's a lot more uh, it's a lot easier to actually get out whereas that's one sort of downside of the old design where this unit itself could snag on something and actually catch as you're taking it out of a bag or or a pocket or something like that now coming on to the actual um, sort of capacity of it so this new one is a 5000 milliamp hour and 18.5 uh, watt hours the input is 5 volt 2 amps so basically 10 volts it charges out uh, 10 watts sorry and the output is 20 watts on the USB-C port and 7.5 for Qi charging. So this will activate the MagSafe uh, sort of ring if you like when you actually put it on to charge and it will charge at MagSafe rates It is a very similar thing on the bottom So you do have to push a button in order to activate the sort of 
battery side of things and then obviously you, you charge it up using the USB-C port just there at the bottom. This underside is made of a rubber sort of material compared to the hard plastic on the original one and that does mean that this will pick up some lint every now and then you might want to give this a quick wipe if you do use your phone uh, without a case if you do use it with a case then it shouldn't really be that much of a problem because it does actually grip on really nicely I have obviously got several videos on my channel for both the Apple MagSafe battery as well as some of the replicas the AliExpress replicas that you can get on the market as well um, in terms of fit finish and everything this is probably closer to the original in comparison to some of those uh, replicas but it doesn't have the same functionality so this is essentially operating as just a external battery pack so it will do everything that an external battery pack will do and it will basically charge as as you control it so as soon as you push the button to actually activate it it will start charging and when you push it or uh, take it off that's when it will stop charging so unlike the Apple uh, MagSafe battery pack this one doesn't really regulate itself it doesn't really control how much juice it's giving so if your phone hits 100% and you've still got it charging it will just kind of deplete itself rather than managing it throughout the day but that obviously is where the price difference also comes in so yeah that's basically just my quick look at the Zero MagSafe battery. I will obviously have all links for all products in the description below. If you do have any questions, just drop me a comment in the comment section below. So that's it for this particular video. If you haven't already done so, please do subscribe as well as hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified whenever I upload any new videos. And I'd also really appreciate if you give this video a thumbs up. It really helps the channel out and helps other people see the videos. And other than that, thanks very much for watching.